What's up guys, Jeremy with Everything I Device, and welcome to another iOS 7 walkthrough. This is going to be of Game Center, and actually I want to cover in this video some of the problems that I'm having on Beta 1, and I'm definitely curious to know, for those of you that do have iOS 7, if you're having these same problems or issues with Game Center. But uh, first off, let's just go ahead and let's jump into Game Center, and uh, I do very much like the overall new look. It's, it's much more um, modern looking than the old corny cliche, you know, felt leather and card style of the old game center so i do like the overall new look uh with these kind of uh bubbles here uh, and believe it or not these bubbles are actually animated uh i'm not sure if you can tell through the camera but if you see it in person they actually kind of wobble a little and just kind of move just slightly which is a really nice effect and i really do like it of course up here you do have your motto your the picture profile of your game center account your game center name so if you guys would like to add me go ahead i like to play challenges um, now, like I said, one of the problems with beta one that I'm having is that it's not fully up to date and it doesn't actually display all my friends yet. It doesn't actually display all the games I've played and or even the points that I've earned or achievements within these games. So, uh, if you guys are having this issue, definitely let me know down in the comments if this is a common thing. I'm very curious to know, but, um, as you can see, you do have these kind of bubbles here and you can click on any of them. It'll go to the corresponding location within game center. Here is where your friends are on the bottom tab there. Um, for some reason, it just gives me recommendations. I don't have all my friends in there right now. Again, like I said, it's, it's just a beta one issue. Also, here we do have the games. You have recommendations. And then below that are my iOS games. Again, like I said, not fully up to date due to the, it being a beta one. So uh, here would be your challenges when your friends send you a challenge. And then your churns for the games that you're playing with your friends. So again, like I said, I really do like this overall new look of Game Center. It's very modern. And it's just easy on the eyes. And I think it's actually a little bit more fun to use. At least it'll be more fun to use when it's fully up to date in further betas or even towards its final release. But still, nonetheless, I think the new Game Center looks great. Again, if you guys are having iOS 7 issues with Game Center, let me know down in the comments. I'm very curious to hear what you guys have to say. And if you guys want to see more iOS 7 coverage, be sure to click that subscribe button. This has been Jeremy with Everything iDevice, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Later.